I got a question. At what point do you charge cleanup fees? Do you uh, wait until there's a spill, somebody throws up in the vehicle, uh, or something, you know, is just severely messy, or do you uh, charge them when a small spill happens? I I'm not really sure what the answer is on this, and uh, maybe I'd like some opinion back on this. I've got uh, here, this is our Chrysler 300, and it went out uh, yesterday, and you can kind of see here all this stuff on the, on the seats here. It's actually wine, and the, this is just trashed so bad in here. Um, everything needs to be cleaned up, and oh my god, it's even all the way on the back seat back there. There's, uh, oh man, look at the back. Uh, I haven't had a light in here yet, so I haven't uh, seen how bad this actually is. Uh, but, as you can see, there's a lot of stuff there. It's, uh... This is going to take uh, at least an hour to uh, give it a deep cleaning on the interior, maybe uh, maybe even longer, maybe even a couple hours, because you know what we're seeing on the seats there—that's red wine. And uh, while I don't think it'll stain those seats, it uh, is an issue that um, the whole vehicle—you <laughs> you can't smell this on video—but I open the door here and it wafts wine. So, you know, this vehicle went out on a wine tour yesterday. Uh, it was out for seven hours. Uh, so the, uh, the amount of, uh, uh, that it earned uh, was uh, pretty good. But, you know, is it, uh, is it worth, um, you know, is it included in the charge to do cleanups like this? Or is that considered excessive? Um, in our H2 Hummer, you know, we had uh, a couple of beers uh, spilled the other night and uh, got into the carpets. And uh, so we finally figured out where the smell was coming from. And uh, we're going to have to take care of that. Uh, gosh, where do you, do we bill for that again? You know, the uh, H2 Hummer's out on a run today that I think is nine hours long. And they're doing more wine stuff. We'll see what it looks like tonight after it gets back. And... Uh, but where do you bill? Do you, I mean, do you bill for this or do you just let it go and uh, take it as part of the normal cleanup? So I like some opinion on that, uh, both from people uh, who are in the industry who uh, deal with this all the time and, uh, or if uh, you're just a customer who rents limousines, I'd be interested to hear your opinion and uh, even your opinion on if we build for cleaning up uh, these wine spills in here, uh, would you be so upset that you wouldn't rent from us again, or would you think that was unfair? So anyway, your opinion would be appreciated. Thank you.